that. The author would most likely agree which which state. I got C. Although David wasn't was not the best painter as a child, he became talented as talented as an adult. So in paragraph six it says making such massive art is not easy. respectfully disagree with you because um, I got A and it says although David's sculptures are interesting they are too large and heavy and on um, paragraph 3 it says that um, how heavy is that it would be like picking up six grown men at once some of David's other bugs are Grasshopper and a citizen bug and a ladybug, all big enough to sit on. And real bugs are tiny. So why did David build his so large? So I got mine as a. I respectfully disagree with you because it says in paragraph six again, some of the bugs took three months to construct. Right. Um, I picked A because, like, it also says, although David's sculptures are interesting, they are too large and heavy. And on paragraph three and four, they say how much they weigh and. Um, and on paragraph four, it says how big they are in real life. And on paragraph three, it says how much they weigh and how heavy they are. So I respectfully disagree with you again because in paragraph seven, it says David began carving pieces of wood into just the right shape and size. So it took like a long time to like make it to the right shape and size. And if you like, like you might fail if you rush. So you have to take time to make it to be the right shape and the right size. Yeah, but look, you can see on the picture that it has, that it's really big and that it also is really big and people can like sit on it and many different types of people can sit on it and it's also big because look on paragraph one it says imagine walking through the park on a sunny day you look up to see a spider twice the size of your head it looks so real that it seems to be creeping down it's web towards me. Before you scream and run away, look closer. That 50 pound spider is a wood sculpture that is made by artist Dave Rogers. And it is one of 14 books he has on display of the parks and gardens around the United States. Well, I disagree with you again because it doesn't show people sitting on it. It shows like, like, look how long it is. If it shows it's like long, it means like it's hard. Like, long sculptures take time, but small take like maybe like short time around like one hour. But like a long sculpture, well, this is not long, but it's big, and it takes so much time to make the perfect thing. Yeah, but what if there were people sitting on it and just because it looks like I'm sitting on it, then it means that people don't sit on it. Yeah, but if it says that, it should be people sitting on it. And if the people, well, it doesn't show people sitting on it, so yeah. But what if the people do want to sit on it? And it's big to hold a lot of people on it. And they can take like pictures for it to, um, to take time. And people can go one at a time. Well, yeah. But it needs to say that and show the picture a 
Well, well, right here, again, it says making massive art is not easy, and David began carving pieces of wood just to make the right shape and size. So it's showing that the right shape and size he did, but no people sitting on it. So what do you think, Brenda? Do you think that she's right, or are you going to change your answer? Yeah, <laughs> you did a great 